Hi everyone! So I know I had already put out a video this week, but I went to the mailbox and I noticed that I had a package from um, the Keeper. And this is the rubber made um, menstrual cup. And my buddy Jennifer had let me know that they had a discount code going at the time. Um, so I went ahead and used that and got $15 off of the original price of $35. And then shipping was $3.75. So I ordered this on the 18th, and that was a Friday, so I understand that, you know, they had to take um, the weekend before they, they shipped it off or s notified the post office um, that a package was ready on the 21st. Uh, that that was a Monday, so it wasn't actually um, scanned into the facility until the 28th, and today is the 30th, which is the day that I received it. So it only took two days to get here, but the processing took quite a while, and it's only coming from Ohio, so uh, it shouldn't take that long. I I ship out packages, and usually they get it within two or three days and that's first class shipping as well and uh, I sew my items uh, although I do have um, I only offer ready to sell items uh, you know I just I don't understand why it took so long for it to um, be sent out so um, this is the envelope that it arrived in and I did just tape over or put a piece of paper over my address here and I started to rip the top but um, it is stapled turn it over it's stapled on uh, all four corners where the the tabs are and then it just has this thing so I'm gonna open it now um, when I ripped it open I noticed that there's a paper on the inside so I stopped ripping it um, so that I didn't rip the, the pamphlet anymore than I needed to or that I did already not needed to. So there's nothing else in the in the envelope but there is a uh, paper here just a leaflet or well, it's a full sheet pamphlet nothing on that side. So here is this side and I'll hold it up if you want to pause it you can uh, without my fingers in the way and if you zoom in, yes, my nail is broken, so I just kind of put super glue and some tissue on it. And this one I put a little bit of acrylic just so that they could grow out enough because they're really uh, far down. Uh, sorry, kind of rambling here. So here is the um, pouch that it came in. And I ordered a size, did I already say this, uh, a size A which is after childbirth and here is the cup so all of these cups are brown and my first impression is that it's a very firm cup um, it has a hard edge for that secondary rim I don't care for that too much there's quite a lot of holes on here and I, I'm not going to count them for you right now um, this seems a lot smaller than I would have expected it to be um, co compared to my other larger cups and I am just realizing that if you can see down in there let me see if I can turn this inside out it is a size B and on my order forms and I think I got two or three notifications that they received my order and that supposedly it was shipped out they all state that I ordered a size A so after that long wait I still got the wrong item um, on the inside it does have um, keeper does it say okay the the <laughs> The keeper, it's molded in and made in USA. And there's this uh, kind of a powdery residue on it, and I'm guessing that's just to keep it from sticking to itself during shipping. Um, so I'm going to have to contact the company, and 
Honestly, I don't know if I want to wait. <laughs> uh, the, the stem is hollow and it is nice and flexible. It makes a lot of noise. So it has this uh, rim that kind of flares out just a little bit, not like not like the um, the bell-shaped cups, but this is the actual rim. So bell-shaped cups usually have a little flare, and then if it has a rim, it, the rim is at the end of that little flare, and this is um, just the rim. But it is quite a firm, firm cup, and it's it's actually not what I had expected at all. I don't know. There's a lot of that powdery residue stuff on it, and you can see that really well. Uh, feels feels weird. Um, so I'm going to have to contact the company, and I, I'm not going to use this one. I'm not going to try it. I am bleeding right now, um, but I'm not going to try it since it is the, the smaller size, the wrong, wrong cup that, that I didn't order. So... But so far, that was my unboxing of this, um, the Keeper Menstrual Cup.